over to LA now and Carl Schmidt has all the Hollywood gossip for us. Move over Harry Styles. Who's Taylor Swift dating now? Morning, Carl. Good morning, Kate. Good morning, Alan. Good morning, everyone. Yes, well, they are never, ever getting back together again. And how do you get over Bret heartbreak? Well, if you're Taylor Swift, you move on to the next guy. And that guy would be British singer Ed Sheeran. Big payday for the actors of Hollywood. I love when they do this. They brought out the list of the highest paid, haven't they? They have. Good morning, Alan and Lorraine. Good morning, everyone. Yes, payday. The numbers are in for the highest paid actors in Hollywood of 2012-2013. Number three on the list, a fellow countryman of mine, Hugh Jackman. He picked up $55 million for his role in Wolverine. Just ahead of him, Magic Mike himself, Channing Tatum. Now, he invested some of his own money in the film about strippers, and the gamble paid off. He takes home a neat $60 million. That should pay for uh, some school fees down the line with the new arrival of Everly. But the top spot, the number one earner, Mr. Iron Man himself, Robert Downey Jr. Of course, his roles in the Marvels, The Avengers, and Iron Man 3 helped him bring home $75 million. Well done him. Top spot last year was Tom Cruise. He's taken a little bit of a tumble down to number eight, but nothing to cry about. Still $35 million richer. You know, it seems like to be a big earner in Hollywood, you've got to be a comic book hero or a stripper. Alex. Now, if, if, it is, if she is chosen, it's a major leap from reality TV star to prime time television presenter. And let's face it, Chloe's going to have a little bit more time on her hands now. They've, uh, they've suspended shooting her reality series, Chloe and Lamar. Lamar wants to get his career back on track. So, uh, you know, Chloe could be the one. And hey, listen, it finally gives us a, an actual reason to watch a Kardashian on television. So watch this space. Carl, don't be cheeky. Now, Beyonce in hot water again. What's going on? I know. Poor Beyonce. First she gets in trouble for lip syncing at the presidential inauguration. Then she's in trouble at the Super Bowl for wearing an outfit made out of iguana and python. Now she's upset the animal rights people once again after rocking a new pair of trainers. Get this. They are made out of crocodile, stingray, ostrich, cow and anaconda. Don't worry, though, no reports at the moment that there's any horse involved. Who would think you could get so many animals in a pair of trainers? But Peter are up in arms, of course, and rightly so. She's practically wearing a zoo on her feet. Although this is time one fan maybe would have helped, uh, hoped he didn't have to have with her. She was performing at a concert recently in Atlanta. It came to a moment in the show where she wanted everyone to sing along. And uh, she looked down and there was a gentleman who was more interested in recording her performance than he was singing. So she did what any diva would do. She got down and, and had a stern word with him, shamed him into singing. Well, he put down his mobile device and joined in and got high praise from, from her. It goes to show that, you know, we spend so much time updating our Facebook statuses and checking these things. Sometimes you put them down, enjoy the moment. And uh, finally, uh, Kristen Stewart, uh, she's been a victim of a car prank. Tell us more. Yeah, look, poor Kristen Stewart. My heart bleeds for this girl. She went into a studio to do some work in North Hollywood and uh, it would seem her car is perhaps a little dirty. Someone wrote in the dust, I love Rob. Well, she wasn't too pleased about that. But listen, it could have been worse, guys. They could have just written, clean me. I mean, you would think a little Hollywood starlet could possibly have a clean car. I don't know. My car's spotless and I'm no <laughs> starlet. Well, exactly. Yeah. You would think that they would if they've not got millions. It's quite funny, though, isn't it? <laughs> to do that. It's a bit cruel. Yeah. A bit cruel. Yes, sorry. Thank you, my love. Great to talk to you. Talk yeah, to nice you to see soon. you. Thank you. Likewise, guys. Oh, he's lovely. We yeah, love him, don't we? Yeah.